Welcome to Curtin, Malaysia. An Australian university situated in the vibrant city of Miri. Home to Malaysia's century-old petroleum industry. And gateway to Borneo's spectacular national parks. This is where expert teaching staff guide students to discovery in the fields of engineering, science, commerce, and the arts. At Curtin, Malaysia, you receive a global education. And the distance between the Malaysian and Perth campuses is no distance at all. You will learn in world-class facilities. Or your classroom might be the stunning natural beauty of Borneo. Here, students from over 45 countries share their culture, knowledge and experiences. And innovation comes from multiple points of view. Beyond academic achievement, Curtin Malaysia prides itself on a culture that promotes community engagement and develops the leaders of tomorrow. This is where you have the space to study, achieve and discover. And where colleagues become lifelong friends. Curtin Malaysia is about following your passion, achieving your potential and gaining a degree that prepares you for the dynamic global marketplace.
Nomada, all right. You just see Nomada everywhere. The diamond So listen to your lectures. And the last thing I want to ask you is ask for help. But don't be shy. Come forward. If you're feeling overwhelmed, if you're feeling a bit unhappy, maybe you're missing mum and dad or the dog or the cat parrot. That's okay. I get that feeling too because often I feel a bit homesick for Australia as well. So I understand that. So come forward and ask for help. Maybe you're sick, you're not quite sure what to do. Maybe you're having trouble making friends. We can help you out with that. Uh, and then you've got all of the student council members, the orientation leaders who will help with that as well. So don't be shy to ask for help. Okay, whether it's about your life, whether it's about your
My name is Marco Ani. Currently in my final year of the company and its future leadership. And I'm from Vancouver. And nice to meet all of you. I'll try to make Hello everyone, uh, my name is Alicia. I am in my final year, final semester, uh, majoring in journalism and corporate screen production. Uh, I'm 22 this year and I am from KK, so I am uh, I'm in group three. So if anyone in group three needs help, come and ask me. And I hope you guys have fun this week. Okay. <laughs> Hi, good morning guys. My name is Sham and I'm studying in electrical and electronics engineering, third year for Sam. So nice to meet you all. If you all have any problems, don't feel shy, just look for all of us. Okay. And now I'll pass it to the next world. Hi guys, hi guys, so it's me again, I'm Rachel, and I'm currently in my year two semester one. I'm taking management marketing. Nice to meet you guys, and I'm in group six. Where's my group six? Uh, Hello, everyone. What? Can everyone hear me? Okay, uh, my name is Shaf. I'm basically an intern for student experience. I am part of group four. I think group four is over there, right? You guys? Okay. Uh, if you guys have any issues, you guys can come to me. And. Uh, I'm from Sabah, by the way. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I'm gonna pass on to my uh, partner here, which is he's also in Hi guys, I'm Crystal, and I'm currently studying management and marketing, and it's my year two sem one. So I'm also in charge of group four. So I hope you guys enjoy your campus life. That's all. Thank you. Hello, my name is Yi Hui. Uh, same like all of you, I'm actually just a uh, year one, semester one student in accounting and finance. Alright, I also come from KL. Anyone come from KL over here? No? Oh, I'm, okay, that's okay. I'm on the back. Okay, so I hope all of you have fun and during your orientation week. Okay, so I'll pass on to my Now I'm taking mechanical engineering year two and one, and I hope you guys are having a great week. And I'm the orientation leader for group five. Group five. Hi. Hi everyone. My name is Wen Hao. Uh, I'm the group leader of group two. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm a student for finance and marketing. I'm also from KL, which no one else is from KL. Except her. Uh, not a scary person, so if you have any questions at all, you can come and ask me. Thank you. Hello. 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 Faculty of Business, Public Relations and Management, and I'm in year two, sem two, and I'm the all else of group one. So nice to meet you all, and to every student, welcome to Curtin University. Hi everyone, can you all hear me? Yes. yes. Hi, my name is Elizabeth. You can call me Ellie. Well, I'm group two OL, so hi. Group two. Now I'm from Kuching, and I'm also taking uh, right now in Berlin. I'm taking chemical engineering in my year three. So I hope you all have an, a fun orientation week with us. Have fun and run. Thank you. <laughs> Hi everyone. Can you hear me well? Yes. Loud enough. Yes. All right. Okay. So my name is Aina. Um, you can call me Aina. Right. 
So I'm currently taking my master's in international business. Uh, I'm in my second semester. I'll be done next semester. Um, all I can say is welcome to Kathy Malaysia, and I hope you guys have a good orientation week. All right? Group six. I mean, you guys. Hello, everyone. Hopefully, you can hear me and see me as well, right? <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm Zed. You can just call me Z. Alright, uh, I'm the orientation leader for group 5. What's group 5? Alright, nice. So I'm taking mechanical engineering in my final year, final semester. And yeah, uh, welcome to Kristen. Alright, hello guys. So my name is Isaac. Alright, you can call me Zach. Then no one else can to call me Zach Akron. Okay, alright. So I'm actually from Penang. Anyone from Penang? No, what? Penang, no, 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 okay, one Penang, okay. All right, guys, so, as so we all know, Penang Laksa is very nice, but then, that will be up on your board. You know, apparently, they say, Sarawak Laksa is even better. So, welcome to Kathy, and also welcome to Sarawak, and make sure to try the Sarawak Laksa and give your opinion. All right, okay, so that's all for me. Welcome to Kathy, and welcome to Sarawak. Thank you for um, working hard for this morning to happen. So please give them a round of applause. Okay, all have a few minutes to get their And now I'll pass my mic to Ki and she will be conducting the rest of the orientation. Okay, thank you. Ayin. So, hi, how is everyone doing today? Good? Everyone? Good? Alright. And so I'll be the one answering for the second part of day one orientation. Let me introduce myself once again. My name is Yi Hui. I'm a year one, semester one student in the company and finance. Okay? So, as all of you are sitting in groups from group one until group six, please do check your orientation kit with the back over there. Right. Is that your Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Then we also will get a lanyard as well as a badge. Okay. 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 The most important one, you make sure you receive the campus map, yeah? So that you when you can refer to it when you are when you got lost on campus, yeah. But then before so I would suggest you to put on the badge on your shirt so it's easier to know each other names. But since we don't have any marker pen to write the names, you can do it after today's orientation. Okay? Before I forget, you will receive an email asking you to sign the disclosure form. Therefore, please sign it and email back to the student service department. Okay. Uh, much better. Anyone know what the next question will be? No. No. Okay. The next question we will be having our ice breaking session. All right, I'm ready. Session, it's time to bond with our with your group members. So, group OLs, please gather your group members and proceed with the ice breaking session. For online students, uh, it's time for your pilot break, and please come back here at ten to five a.m. as we will have more sessions later on. So, students in this hall, please follow your group OLs. 
They will gather you and proceed with the answer to session. Group one or else? Group one or else? Group one? Okay, you can follow Isaac and Ayin. breaking session inside this hall. Alright, okay. Good. Okay. Alright, I will go to my group then. I try to say louder, but can hear. <laughs> Give me a favor. Put this big. Put for it. Everyone can hear me, right? 
Ito na wala. Ano no? Because our equipment is still here. Is this gonna be third? I hope it's not. That's the thing. I don't. I don't know what's. <laughs>
from people. Uh, And you can just like go front, front here, and then you can just like point to any one of them, and then they need to squat, and then they pull it out. Uh, you should...
Ja. Can we do this? 
Can you make it to point in? Yes. Let's go. All right, let's go. Reach until 10, right? 11. 11. All right. 12. 13. 13. All right. Please be careful. <laughs> 15, alright. 14, anyone? 14. 15. Alright. 17, alright. 17, do we get an 18? Alright, nice. 19, alright. Okay, so it's getting me. 19. Do we have a 20? Last time we messed up at 20, so be careful. 20. Watch out. 20. 20. 20. 21. Oh! That's a good
24, all right. So now I'll take a deep breath, take a deep breath. The last time we reached 27. So let's put it here until the next 10 minutes. We have 24. 24. Okay, 25. Yeah, I'll count that. 25. We need a 26 now. All right, 26. Watch out. 27. <laughs> Yeah, 27. 27. All right, nice, nice 27. Okay. So now we go to the previous one. Let's go further ahead. 28, come on. Again? Yes. All right, nice. 28. Let's go. 29. We need a 29 here. All right, 29, let's go. All right, nice, 30. Come on, seven more. <laughs> 31, all right. Oh, my heart is pumping. <laughs> 31. Do I have a 32? Any thirty two? All right, nice thirty two. Oh, we have reached so far. Do we have a thirty three? Thirty three. All right, nice, 33, four more. We can do this. Do we have 34? Any 34? 34. All right, 34, nice, three more. Come on, we can do this. All right, why are you so confused? <laughs> We have to be fast. In more than five seconds, we lose. 39. 39. 40. 40. Two seconds, let's go. We need a 41. 41. All right, 41. In five seconds, 42. 42. Guys. 43. 43. 44. 45. 45. All right. So we, let's close it to 45. All right. So good job, everyone.
Thank you.
So, uh, for the person in charge in housing, uh, if you have any question, uh, you can either email to housing at 13 or you can call the extension number 2578. We look for either Miss Ruth or Miss Benny and Benny Bonifaz. They are the housing services. So, the housing uh, office is located at Frontier Street, it's at the ground floor. And the office operating hours is Monday, Friday to Friday, at to 4 o'clock. And the phone number is uh, here at 5630100, uh, extension 2578 number. Okay, now we will come to the spot and reflection uh, services there. Yeah? Okay, uh, these are the facilities that is uh, that we provide at the moment. So we have indoor badminton court, we have indoor basketball court, uh, indoor netball court. Uh, these are located at the red ball. We have the gym, we have cardio room, cardio corner, or the dance hall. And we also have table tennis. Yeah? This hall is, uh, is located at the red hall, level 3. And at the multi purpose hall, which is located at the lakeside uh, accommodation, we also have food star court, uh, volleyball court, and also a dutch ball court. Uh, for the outdoor facilities, we have tennis court, we have football field, we have rugby field, basketball field, food star court, volleyball, table account, and also a uh, All of these uh, facilities, if you wish to book, you please go to the uh, spot and rec website and best the things there. Huh? So, for any question regarding uh, spot and rec, you can uh, email to me uh, at srs at 13 the edu m huh? So, my office also open from uh, 9 to 4 o'clock. Huh? Um, for the team, at the moment, the gym is still closed. But uh, if there's any new updates regarding the opening of the gym, we will let you know, you guys know by email. At the moment, this is the current uh, gym fee. Yeah? So for new registration, it's 20 ringgit. This is one off only. And for weekly pass, uh, it will be 10 ringgit. So any membership must start on the first day of the month. I think you cannot uh, try to join in the middle of the month. You will start on the first day of every month. Yeah? And for the monthly pass, at the moment, the price is 35 ringgit. Uh, please note that this price is subject to change yeah? because we are, uh, we are in the midst of reviewing the price, so there might uh, be a slight increase in the membership price. Okay, these are the facilities looking and great. I think this is a bit too small, uh, but you can uh, see the rates uh, at the website. So, there will be uh, if you join the gym membership. You be uh, you can enjoy a uh, discounted rate to use all the facilities mentioned just earlier. So, for example, if you were to use the badminton court, if you have an active gym membership, the court will just cost uh, ten ringgit an hour. But if you if you are not a gym member, uh, gym member, it will cost about eighteen ringgit. We also provide uh, some fitness tests. So if you want to join any of the fitness tests uh, organized by the sport and rec department, so what you need to do is just to email to us at uh, srs.edu.my or if you have any uh, ideas or any uh, sport related activities that you wanted to organize, that you want to collab collect with the sport, sport and rec department, you just email to us, or you can directly go to my, my number also, right? Yeah. That's all for me, yeah? Anything you can either email to housing or email to spot the right department, yeah? Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Ekram, for the briefing. All right, up next, we will have, uh, all of you will be given a
business school, including the online students. So for online students, later on we will play a virtual campus tour video for you. And after the video, you can go for your lunch break and you can join our afternoon session just by clicking on the event thing later on. Yeah, so thank you. And for students in this call, Please follow your group of us later as they will be the one who will bring you your campus tour. Hold on. Listen to me, I'm going first. Okay? Let's a lot of bags, water bottles, iPad, everything. And then you will be able to go for your lunch after your campus tour, alright? And I have a short request announcement to make is that please come back here before 1 p.m. Alright, we'll see you at 1 p.m. here. Alright, and you will also follow our IG page as we have posted a lot of stories for this morning session. So you can see whether you can write inside our IG story. Okay? So, group 1 OL. Welcome to Curtin University of Malaysia. This is the campus tour video which should help you better navigate the campus. When you first arrive, you should be right here at the Curtin bus stop located in Falcon 2. One of the notable spots here is the Curtin Bookshop where you can purchase your textbooks, access cards, and lab coats as well as locate the mail and courier services. Among the other notable spots here include the student council's office as well as convenience stores for snacks and drinks and electronics. There's plenty of other buildings to look at, so let's get to it. So here you are inside the main building, also known as Huron 1. Inside you'll find the Student Services Department, also known as the SSD, which handles all student academic related matters. Further inside you'll find the International Students Office, which handles all international student related matters. Outside there is the Security Office, as well as two ATMs with RHB and Maybank. On the first floor we have the new study area, also known as the NSA, which is a study space which is open 24 hours a day for students. And on the top floor, we have staff offices. Here we are inside the main building for the Faculty of Business, also known as Huron 2. Here on the ground floor, you'll find two lecture theaters named LTBS1 and LTBS11, as well as nine tutorial classrooms called LTCL2 to LTCL10. On the first floor, you'll find the offices for all your deans and lecturers. Right outside the Faculty of Business building, you'll find the Curtain Trading Room, which is a specially designed building for finance students to practice livestock trading. Okay, right now we are inside the Huron 3 building, also known as the Rec Hall. Here on the ground floor, you'll find all of our indoor basketball and badminton courts, as well as the Curtain Gym. On the first floor, you'll find the Cardio and Aerobics Room, and if you have any questions regarding our sporting facilities or services, you should be able to find the answers to those on our Sports and Recreational Services webpage. 
And over outside, we also have the Azman Islamic Center. Okay, right now we're inside the Prinia 1 building. I have to speak a little softly right now because I'm in the Student Learning Commons, which is another 24-hour study space for students to go to, and that's on the first floor. Also up here you'll find the Journalism Studio, the Radio County, and the ICT-1 Computer Lab. On the ground floor, you'll find the Office of Student Affairs, Health Counseling and Disability Services, as well as the Student Experience Office and a Medical Center. Now we are in the Prenia 2 building. This building is primarily used by MassCom students. Here on the ground floor, in addition to classrooms, we have a computer lab, a journalism lab, a media equipment storage room, a cinema light, and a design studio. Up on the first floor, we have all the offices for the lecturers and deans of the Faculty of Humanity and Health Science, as well as the MPU lecturers. Here we are in the Prenia 3 building. This building is used by students across all disciplines on campus. On the ground floor, we have tutorial classrooms and computer labs. And here on the first floor, we have more tutorial classrooms, as well as the entrance to the Prenia 2 offices for our faculties of humanities and health science. Right now, we're in the SK3 building, also known as Skylark 3, which is the main building for the Faculty of Engineering and Science. On the ground floor, you'll find three lecture theaters named SK3, 102, 103, and 104. On the first floor, there is the Collaborative Learning Space and Distributed Learning Center. And the two floors above serve as the faculty office for the deans and lecturers. We also have Skylark 1 and 2, also known as the ME and CE buildings. The CE building houses labs for all engineering disciplines, and the ME building houses chemistry, physics, and electrical labs mainly used by foundation students. Hi guys, this is the Curtin Auditorium, which has 400 capacities. This is used for classes events and workshops. Welcome to the Curtin Library. We have three floors here. We have the ground floor, first floor and the second floor. On the ground floor, we have the study areas and the discussion rooms. On the first floor, we have the study areas and computer lab. While the second floor, we have the study areas and discussion rooms. Welcome to the Harry Perkins Nature Theatre. It is known as the LT201 in your timetable. It is used for lectures and workshops. Hi guys, this is the LT Foyer and it is known as Falcon One. Clubs normally open their booth here and have events here. Alright, this is the Curtain Cafeteria. Don't worry, it's 100% halal. It has a wide variation of food. Uh, due to a semester break right now, it is not open for all the stores, but when semester starts, all the stores will be open and you guys can come and enjoy all the foods you want. Alright, so we will be showing you the Hornbill 2. It has two engineering studios for engineering students to have classes inside. And this is the Hornbill 1. It has two ICT labs, that is 24 hours, the ICT Lab 2 and ICT Lab 3. It also has the ICT Help Desk. If you guys want to uh, activate your access card, you can come here and you can solve your ICT problems here also. So this is the housing services. It is important for students who are living under curtain accommodation. You guys can make payments or uh, complaints only regarding to curtain housing. Alright, here is the lakeside area, as also known as the Kingfisher area. All of the lakeside accommodations are over here, as well as the lakeside cafe, the dobby, and the multi-purpose hall. Alright, so that's all for the campus tour video, and I hope to see you guys soon on campus. My name is Kaying, and bye-bye.